For nearly nine months, John Flores has gone almost every day to see his friend at the hospital. She was involved in the hit and run. He says police haven't found the person responsible yet. Fox Force Jacob Sloan spoke with him today about her case. He joins us live tonight. Jacob. He said that she was involved in a hit and run here at 27th and Wabash, right in front of the KCPD East Patrol Division. And yeah, he's frustrated that there haven't been any answers in the case that has now resulted in the death of his friend. Esleen Langford has been fighting for her life since December 27th, 2023. She had got a, a femur broke, her pelvis was broke, um, she had two blood bleeds and she just ain't never recovered from it. Back in December, police said Langford was crossing the street at 27th and Wabash when she was hit by a black sedan that didn't stop. It hurts me to see her this way now, you know, because she's a very, very good person. Nearly nine months later, Flores says that he's been frustrated by the lack of answers from Kansas City police about her case. I'm upset. I want answers for this, this woman who didn't ask to be hit by a car. All she was doing was going to the store. It just hurts that, that here I'm trying to find out what happened to her, you know, to, to get her some help or whatever, you know, because she ain't got nothing. He says he's been at the hospital with Langford nearly every day since the accident, but no one else has come. They sent paperwork out to all her family members that she's supposed to know, none of them answers. And so, like I said, I'm here. I'm not going to leave her side no matter what. You know, she needs somebody and I'm here for her. You know, it's just a why I would want somebody to do for me. Around 1130, Flores says they decided to stop giving Langford life supporting measures. I, I whispered in the ear, I said, I said, baby, just going home. I'll be there. I'll see you again, too. And it was only a few minutes after speaking with Flores outside of Research Medical Center when he called back, reporting that Langford had passed away. But Flores says he will continue to fight for answers for his friend. Someone is going to get away from murder because it's not just a hit and run no more. To me, this is a murder. Someone has to know somebody who had that car who hit her. Someone has to know. We did reach out to KCPD for an update on their investigation. They last we heard they were checking. We did not get an answer. Jacob Sloan, Fox 4, working for you.